Okay, so today's product review is going to be on a beauty tool rather than a product, so I hope that's okay. Um, but it's going to be on the Sephora brush set. It comes in this cute little pink box, and it's like magnetized. Um, it was only $29, I believe, from Sephora, and it comes with five brushes. And I'll just show them to you really quick. There's a blush brush, or like a powder brush, I guess. An eyeshadow brush, a smudge brush, a lip brush, and a bent eyeliner brush. So I'll tell you about them like more in detail. The um, casing on them is a little bit cheap. You can like kind of hear what I'm talking about. It's a really light plastic. They're really not like heavy duty, um, so they don't really feel like really great quality brushes. Um, it's somewhat soft. It's not really soft. But I mean, they do the job, and for $30 for five brushes, um, I thought it was a really good deal, especially for a beginner. If you already have brushes, like from Sigma or from MAC, I wouldn't bother getting these. These are definitely for someone who is not used to using brushes, and you just really want to like give them a try and see um, what kind of brush you might like, and it might help you make a more informed decision when you go and buy expensive brushes. So that's why I got them, and I'm really glad I did, because I do really like them. This one I use for my powder foundation, and um, it does shed a little bit, but not so much anymore. Um, but yeah, I use this for my powder foundation almost every day. Um, the smudge brush, I really, really like. It really packs on color, and I use it um, for the outer V a lot, and for the inner corner as well. And um, yeah, I just really like it. The bent eyeliner brush, I'm really not that impressed with. I was really excited because I've always wanted one, but um, I think my gel liner is a little bit too thick. I use the Maybelline um, Eye Studio gel liner, and it's a little bit... Um, it's definitely too thick for this brush. It's a little bit flimsy. So what I use this for actually is to apply colored eyeshadow on my lower and upper lash lines, and I find it works really, really well for that. But for my gel eyeliner, I don't really use it. Then the lip brush, I really don't use for lip products because I really don't... I don't know, I've never used a brush for lip products. So what I use this for is actually precisely um, applying color onto my lid, like if I want it to be really packed on, like a heavy color, I don't know. Um, if you want to make an outer V with this, it's actually really, really effective. And I like it for that. And also for um, eyeliner as well, you can use this because it's just kind of like flat and... I don't know, like it's a kind of multi-use brush and I didn't even think I would use it when I got it. I was like, what am I going to use a lip brush for? But I found like actually a ton of uses for it. You can use it for the inner corner. It's actually really, really useful. So somehow this became one of like my favorite brushes of the kit, which is really strange because I wasn't expecting that to happen. Then the last one is an eyeshadow brush, and this is probably the most, I don't want to say disappointing brush of them all, but um, it's really, it's just a brush, like it's not anything special, you can't really do a lot with it, aside from maybe highlight, I don't know, I've never highlighted with it, but I mean you could, and you can just use it for applying color on your lid, but it's not like, it doesn't apply it really pigmented or anything like that, it's just an eyeshadow brush, it's just basic, It's it does what it's supposed to do, I guess, but I mean, um... The lip brush is my favorite, I think, and the smudge brush is really good too. And then the powder brush I use every day, although I've used better powder brushes before. I just kind of like them because they just all fit neatly in this little case. I'll show you how they like look when they're in there. And there's actually room for like other brushes if you need to add more. And it's really, really good for traveling. You can just throw it in your bag and then take it with you. So it looks like this. And then there's like room for any other ones you want to throw in there. I don't know, just these two random ones. And yeah, so I really like the fact that it comes with a case, and it's five brushes for $30, and really good for beginners, so I definitely recommend this if you're just starting out. But yeah, don't get it if you already have, like, more expensive brushes, because these will not, it won't stand up to the brushes you already have if they're, like, MAC or Sigma or anything like that. Um, so yeah, that's what I have to say about those. I hope it's helped some of you guys out. If you want to try these out if you're a beginner, I definitely would tell you to go out and buy these because they do do a pretty good job. So anyways, I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.